Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city center, ahead of the 2022 World Cup final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Japan against England. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. Osako. Well, spot on with that challenge. Foden. How can he take them on and beat them? But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Osako. Endo. Mina Mina. Now, who can he play it to? But the danger averted for now. Throw in here for England. Chilwell. Sterling. Mount. That's how to rob them of possession. Promising sequence. And Sterling has it. Oh, yes! First to score in this final. And it could be highly significant. Well, let's take another look now. And it's a superb cross by Sterling. And it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. Goal. Are back underway. And 1-0 it is. Let's we'll see what happens next. Plenty of support here, and credit is due for that good piece of defending. So nearly at half-time, and the home side trailing, albeit not by much. Stuart, your thoughts up to this point? Well, it's been a tight first half so far, but they haven't quite shown enough guile in the attacking third. If, however, they can be more dynamic in the 1v1 situations, they have the quality to turn this around. But on you go, says the referee. Advantage. Well, a foul after the previous one. And the free kick ensues. The there will be one minute added on at the end. And the goalkeeper under no pressure. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Coming up at half time, there will be a display from the police dog display team. So stay in your seats for that. So back underway here. Advantage England after the first 45, but plenty of time for a few twists and turns before this one is over. Calvin Phillips. A real defensive commitment there. Well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. Well, that's a free kick he'll want to forget all about. Well, just look at the reaction of his teammates. That's a real waste. Ito. Osako. Mina Mina. And teammates around him. This could be the equaliser. They had to react and did. Declan Rice. Oh, he's through here. And a goal to increase the lead in this final. Will they be stopped now? Well, as you can see, this is absolutely brilliant. He's such a good runner with the ball, and it's a great individual goal. Brilliant from him. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. So the ball rolling again, and 2-0. Really good challenge.
Mount. Can he finish this? He's got to score! There it is! The goals keep coming! No stopping them today! Well, I won't get tired of watching this. It's an outstanding bit of play. Just look how far he runs with the ball. That's a great goal. Here it is now, a substitution. For England. So underway seven, again, and England really beginning to run away with this now. The scoreline threatening to get ugly here. Mount, Kane. Alert defending. Well, that's how to dispossess your opponent. Walker, well, good use of the ball. But can they make one of these passes count? Well, good clean catch by the keeper. Ito. Furuhashi. The fourth so official one minute of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. And there goes the final whistle. England have won the World Cup for the first time since 1966. And I have to say, Derek, they fully deserve it.